And the winner for the book of the year for older children is The Bone Sparrow. <laughs> Um, wow. <laughs> um, thank you all so much. Uh, it feels really amazing. And, um, you know, for me, winning the Arbia, it's, it's everything. Um, it represents everything that I love about writing. The, the teamwork, the collaboration. It takes so much to create a book. Could you share with us a little bit about your favourite Australian story and one that might have inspired you to start writing? Yeah, I have many, but um, I think probably The Secret River by Kate Grenville. It was really, you know, I read that, I read that book and I thought if I can write like this, it'd be just amazing. And you know, I think it's something I've aspired to ever since. So it's great. Uh, my next book is The Ones That Disappeared and it's coming out uh, 25th of June, um, published by Lothian. Uh, and it's about um, some uh, refugee children who are unaccompanied minors who are trafficked into modern day slavery. Um, and it came about through research I'd been doing uh, while doing the Bone Sparrow and I found this article about kids who are trafficked in slavery and there being a big increase in modern day slavery because of this. 